And welcome back to our live show. Big Herm's baking partner, Leanne Fletcher, is here with us in the kitchen today. We're going to pass along a little recipe for a mini cheesecake. And this one is for adults because it features an Irish cream liqueur. Hi, Leanne. Hello. Good to see yes. you. We've been doing a lot of cheesecakes lately, and today's is a little different in that it's a no-bake cheesecake. It is a no-bake cheesecake, and it is, it is very quick. So, you know, come go grab a couple of these ingredients, and, you know, you can have dessert tonight. And you don't have very many ingredients, which is the, Again. the neat thing. We're going to start start with whipped cream yes. and that that is a, a, an art in itself in, in making <laughs> it, this it is an art in itself um, and we've made it a couple of times on, on here, on mm -hmm. air. Um, but this one you cannot buy, unfortunately, so you will have to make this one. Mm -hmm. Sometimes people try to cheat with the recipes that I have and say, I'll just buy the Cool Whip. Um, but this one has some extra ingredients, so yeah. So we'll start that one. Um, again, I love to have my bowl in the freezer when I'm doing Cool Whip. Um, again, it's just taking the, the cold whipping cream and putting it inside there just makes it a whole lot easier. Yeah, um, it, it helps it to stand up. It does, it does. So if not, it can be in there for a very long time. So you're using heavy cream. So that heavy about whipping, two cups about, actually about a cup okay. um, of heavy whipping cream. And we're gonna get that started and going. Um, again, as you know, that can take a little bit yep. to, to whip up. It takes a while. So while that's doing that, um, I have my famous Ziploc bag. Um, and again, it's just so that the kids you know, can get involved in baking. So if it's something like this that they can do while you're chopping up something or doing something else, it's, you know, a whole lot. Of, right. Just it makes it fun for the whole family. We're making the crust yep. here. So you've got so just, chocolate wafer cookies. I just have some Oreo cookies in there. Again, if you want to change the recipe up and do it as something a little bit different, you certainly can. But again, just crushed Oreos. You can take a rolling pin. You can roll it out mm -hmm. um, to crush them. You can have the kids crush them in their hands, whatever they feel like doing. I like this because it makes cleanup a lot easier. It too. does. <laughs> no bowls. You know, there's nothing falling out. Um, so we just take um, some of this that we have down here at the bottom. The crumbly part. The crumbly part. Because you're making individual servings. We're making individual servings for this one, yep. And so we're just going to place that down at the bottom. And that is looking good. So what we'll do here is slow this down. Now, the heavy whipping cream has already came and, and had its peaks. Okay. Um, so we're going to add about a tablespoon of cocoa powder to it and a tablespoon of the confectionate sugar, and that's gonna give it that sweetness oh, yeah. um, for it. And then have that whipped up for a little bit more, and then we'll add our secret ingredient in a second. Um, so this is the cheesecake part that we've already done. Again, it's still simple. Um, we have about eight ounces of cream cheese that we have. Um, put a little bit of, of cocoa powder, a little bit, about a quarter cup of sugar inside of it, and then of course our secret ingredients, um, the Baileys. The add, cream. Add in the mm -hmm. Baileys um, for it. And so, and because this is a no-bake, again, there's nothing to bake out the alcohol. We so are this not is baking out the alcohol dessert. <laughs> at all for this one. Um, and so, again, just lay that one on there. And I'm not a big cream cheese fan at all, but with the cocoa powder in this and with the sugar, you really cannot taste the cream cheese um, in it. A lot it, of people so. don't like the tang of the cream cheese. It's not, so you don't have that tang. And again, if you want to add more cocoa powder, mm -hmm. because you you know you still can taste it a Make little it bit, chocolatey. you certainly can do that. See, I don't have a problem with that. I love cream <laughs> cheese. <laughs> all right. And now that's all nice and whipped, so we're going to add our secret ingredient, which is about a tablespoon to two tablespoons of Baileys. Mm -hmm. um, and again, this is no bake, so it stays in. It's not Keep baking it out from the kids. at all mm -hmm. <laughs> um, for it. And that's it. It's done. Um, and we can see oh, the that looks beautiful. Yeah, we can see the consistency Look at on that. there. That's lovely. Um, for it, and it's really nice and thick. And again, you can always scrape your bowls um, down on the sides too, just to to make sure everything is all incorporated inside there. Yeah, you want to make sure you mix everything up. And then we just take a portion of that, put that on top, spread it around. So really not parfait layers, just the two layers. Just the two layers. And again, depending on the size that you have, if you want it, you know, to have it a little bit more um, in there, you can certainly get a bigger glass or a bigger cup. But cream cheese is so rich that, that a small serving satisfies. It does. This is something it's, you don't want to do big servings on. Like when you do a cheesecake, you don't cut large slices. Certainly, absolutely. And then again, you can top it with whatever you want to top it. You can um, do a little bit of chocolate syrup on top. You can do a cherry on top. Um, and then that, that is the, the finished product right there. So voila. Um, for it. Um, Good for to it. go. So yeah, it's very easy. And again, no bake. 
Um, you're not going to put it in the oven. You don't have to worry about water baths, any of that <laughs> stuff. It is it is done. The baking part scares a lot of people about making cheesecake, so it does. this makes it a lot easier. It does. And we'll take this recipe and put it on our website by uh, early this afternoon, by about 2 o'clock. Check for that at WTVR.com slash VTM. Thank you, Leanne. Yes, absolutely. Take this and have a taste while we go. take a commercial break, and we'll be right back. <laughs> 